Okay, here we are back up on the roof again. I've got the plywood cut off behind the chimney all the way across. And well, I'll show you. We got kind of a sloppy repair here. No doubt this board here probably split when they were probably trying to take it apart. And what I think I'm going to try and do is rip it the same width all the way down. You can see another section down here, right there, right here that has split out as well. So it's uneven. So if I get that the same width, I should be able to get a nice piece back in there. And I've got to anyway. This board, that's completely rotted there. And um, I'll go down here. This is an interesting uh, tie-in here. Um, not sure why it was like that. But we're going to square it up and put that back together straight. And then have a nice repair there. And a good nailer. Here's something that was a little... Must have been in a hurry, though, I'll tell you what. Maybe it was going to rain or something that day, but this here, are, that's some of the original shingles right there. That was underneath the plywood. That didn't even get pulled up. So, um, yeah, when we got down to the chimney here, it might have just been, oh boy, we don't want to mess with this. So, um, that's good. That's, that's all good. We're going to get it fixed up right and square this off. These couple boards here, I still haven't decided if I'm going to take them off or not. They're not that bad, but it wouldn't be that hard either. So um, I may just do that. But we'll get, um, there's three boards there then. And one across the back. And I'm going to have to go all the way across. On this other side, clear back, I'll probably just go right out to the uh, end of the overhang. Probably it's another two feet out past the tent. So, yeah. I'm a little worried about the rafter. It doesn't look the greatest. It's, um, a little funky and really not an option of changing it at this point, mainly because of the uh, permalog that's on the house now. So um, we'll let that leave that open, let it dry a little bit more, and. Once you put back together, at least it won't leak there, and uh, it should get any worse. So that's where we're at. We've got most of the tear-out done. I'm going to put together a material list, what I need to bring back. Then we start uh, putting it back together. Then I'm going to build the saddle up behind here and start flashing and all that good stuff. So more movie making.